Hello students, in the last session we discussed about the undifferentiated marketing strategy. Today I will start the session with differentiated marketing strategy. What is the meaning of differentiated marketing strategy? Differentiated marketing strategy is a strategy of dividing the total market of a concern into several homogeneous consumers on the basis of common characteristics of the consumers. Uh, differentiated marketing strategy means that means the total homogeneous market of the firm is divided into several segments and the different products are offered uh, to the different uh, uh, segments. Uh, I'll give the example uh, that is the shoe, uh, shoe market, uh, shoes market. Uh, in this shoes market, we can divide the shoes market into we can divide the shoes market on the basis of the sex, the shoes for uh, gents and shoes for the ladies. Uh, this is most popular uh, in our, this is most popular strategy in our country. For example, uh, Hindustan Liver Limited are uh, producing uh, different types of toilet soaps such as, uh, um, uh, such as uh, Lux, uh, Pierce, Lux, Pierce, Life Boy, Life Boy Gold, etc. Uh, etc. The differentiated marketing strategy has a certain has certain advantages. They are it is consumer oriented strategy. It provides maximum satisfaction to the customers. It attracts large number of consumers from all concerns because here they are producing different, different uh, varieties of uh, product uh, uh, for the purpose of to satisfy the consumers and it uh, maximize the sales and profit of the firm. Uh, so marketing can be more specialized and better suited promotional activities can be undertaken under this uh, strategy and it makes the marketing program more competitive. In the differentiated marketing strategy, uh, differentiated marketing strategy suffers from uh, some uh, limitation, uh, limitations or the, or the drawbacks. They are different products are to be produced for different segments of the market to satisfy the needs of the customers and it requires intensive marketing research, product planning and development etc. Different marketing programs and strategies are required and it increases overall cost of the product and it is useful for firms producing the different products on a large scale. The next one is concentrated marketing strategy. Concentrated marketing strategy is a strategy under this the firm concentrates on marketing efforts not in the total market but in some selected segments of the market means here they are selecting uh, some segments okay uh, the advantages of concentrated marketing strategy it provides best possible satisfaction to the consumers because they are focusing only on uh, selected segments and it facilitates the maximum exploitation of the resources of the enterprise. It decreases the cost of production and management and administrative, uh, administrative cost substantially and it helps the firm to earn maximum profits with the limited resources of the firm. And finally, this strategy is most or uh, sorry, uh, quite suitable for introducing a uh, new products. Uh, means uh, here they are concentrating uh, only a selected segment. So that's why uh, this, uh, this uh, strategy strategy uh, helps to reduce the cost of production uh, and it uh, helps the firm to earn maximum profits and disadvantages there are there are many disadvantages uh, there are two important advantages in the concentrated uh, strat uh, concentrated marketing strategy they are uh, this strategy increases the possibilities of uh, competition and this strategy is very risky uh, if we selected a long uh, sorry if we selected a wrong uh, segments uh, definitely uh, the existence of the firm is uh, an endangered. Uh, the next one is uh, 
these are all the important uh, uh, marketing strategies uh, uh, towards marketing segmentation. Uh, the next one is selection of a suitable marketing strategy for market segmentation. Strategy for the market segmentation involves heavy expenditure for its impl for market segmentation. They are the first one is financial resource of the firm. Next one is selection of a suitable marketing strategy for market segmentation. There are many strategy for the market segmentation. The firm can choose any of these strategy. Uh, the strategies has its own merits and uh, demerits. Uh, uh, the impo uh, some important factors must be considered while they are uh, selecting the um, uh, strategy for market segmentation. Uh, the first one is financial is resource of the firm. The strategy for market segmentation involves a heavy expenditure for its implementation. Financial resource of the firm influence the selection of marketing strategy for the market segmentation. Uh, if the firm has adequate financial resources, then the firm can adopt the, uh, in, uh, adopt the differentiated marketing strategy or undifferentiated marketing strategy. If it has not got uh, adequate financial resources, then the segmentation for the market cannot be undertaken at all. The second one is homogeneous nature of a market. If the market is of homogeneous nature, there is not much use of segmentation for uh, uh, segmentation for a market. When the customer preferences vary from group to group, means uh, where there is a uh, uh, where there is a product uh, is of a heterogeneous nature, then the market segmentation is required and it is uh, useful. The next one is product characteristics or homogeneity of uh, products. Uh, the next one is homogeneous nature of a market. When the market is of homogeneous nature, there is not much use of segmentation for the market. Uh, segmentation of market. When customer preference vary from group to group means where there is a heterogeneous market, then the segmentation for market is required and it is useful. The next one is product characteristics or, or homogeneity of uh, products. Uh, the product is of uh, where the product is of when the product is of homogeneity in nature, then the firm can select the uh, undifferentiated marketing strategy uh, but where there is a heterogeneous product then the uh, then the firm adopt a differentiated marketing strategy the next one is nature of customers if the customs habits and attitudes of the consumers are similar then the undifferentiated marketing strategies may be selected if it is different means the customs habits and attitudes are not similar then the differentiated marketing strategy or concentrated marketing strategies may be selected next one is position or stages of product in the product life cycle. Uh, in the first stage, in the introductory stage, data cannot be collected. Uh, therefore, the market, uh, therefore, the marketing segmentation is meaningful. Uh, so, the firm can select the undifferentiated marketing strategy. In the second stage, in the growth stage, firm um, select the concentrated marketing strategy. In the maturity and saturation stage, the differentiated marketing strategy can be adopted. In the decline stage, concentrated marketing strategy can be adopted. And finally, in the obsolescence stage, better to discontinue the product, uh, then there is no question will arise about the selection of marketing strategy. Means the questions of selection of marketing strategy does not arise. And the next one is marketing strategies of the competitors. If the competitors have selected the differentiated marketing strategy, then the enterprise also select the same uh, 
same otherwise it cannot be successful and the last one is government policy uh, government policy is um, uh, this strategy is uh, affected uh, by the this strategy is affected by the government orders if the government has issued the orders for producing a cheap varieties of cloth then definitely the firm uh, select the concentrated marketing strategy if there is no interference or orders of the government then the differentiated or undifferentiated marketing strategy may be selected so these are all the important um, uh, uh, these are all the important uh, uh, suitable marketing uh, these are all the important uh, uh, factors uh, uh, the firm must be considered while they are selecting the uh, suitable marketing strategy for the market segmentation thank you